Welcome everyone to a new video. Yesterday we did vaccinate all the birds, the young birds and the old birds as well. So last night we uh, leave them uh, together. We have to now outside and when the birds are back inside, I will separate them once again. And then we leave them uh, that way until the season starts. With the season, um, only the day that they come home, the Saturday, they will see each other. And uh, otherwise they will be uh, separated. So. That's how we're gonna play it. So we just cleaned the loft, here we still have some youngsters, these two, some darker blue ones, looking really nice, and here we have two, I think maybe one will a blue bar and the other one red one, I'm not sure, we will see, they're doing fine. Swedish are in the Sputnik, the old birds are flying around, but I will show you. So all the birds are back inside, so we're gonna separate the hens and then we're gonna feed the birds and then we are ready for the day. Here we have the youngsters just chilling around. I like that the birds are this way, calm and relaxed. This one always comes to me. Also, if I have the bowl with food, he uh, comes flying to me. So. Wait. Youngsters back. So we close the door and then we will get the hands. We separate them and then we're gonna feed. First we're gonna hand feed the young birds. They are hungry as you can see. They can eat enough every day, but yeah, they want to eat a lot, of course. So first of all, we're doing just this, so that they can yeah, 
get to know me and my hand and that they don't uh, get stressed if I want to catch them. Here we have two It's not bad if the birds are this hungry, it's just because we feed them only once a day. But the leftovers that they left from this day, they will eat tomorrow. These birds are getting 25 to 30 grams a day, and that's more than enough for this period. They don't train that hard like the old birds do, so that's why they don't need that much. They even are on uh 50% breeding mixture with uh 50% gabi from an aardbeelen. The gabi from an aardbeelen is a lighter mixture for the shorter distance mostly. And the breeding mixture is uh, a lot of smaller, heavier of course. So. Yeah, this way the young birds know me, know that I give them food and yeah, that they don't afraid of me, so that's the most important part. So we did the first things, now we will feed in the feeding tray and then we uh, gonna get some water for the birds as well and then we are done. This middle bird feeding his youngsters, the last one for this season. You will see, we have four youngsters of this pair. So we'll see how they fly. Maybe uh, for next year, we're also putting this pair together, but we'll see. Here we have another pair as well. Youngsters are done within a week, I think. And then we'll separate them as well. And then, uh, Waiting season will start. Here we have all the hens separated. We have half an hour until the lights will go out. So I will uh, put the darkening down. And then we are ready for today. Here we are with the youngsters, they're almost done eating. As you can see, there's some food left in the feeding tray. Just for tomorrow morning. I won't come here in the mornings. Only uh, when it's light outside in the morning, so uh, within a few weeks I will. Then also we're gonna train the old birds in the morning and the young birds in the evening. So. Then I will feed them twice a day. Now I will still feed them once a day. So here we have the darkening closed. They also need to do it with all birds. The hen, the male birds, I mean. Just close the door. The male birds. This part is a little bit darker when I put this one down, as you can see. But still, they have enough light to feed the youngsters, so it won't be a problem. We also did a refill on the drinking bowl, so they have enough. So guys, this was the video. I hope you liked it. Please give a thumbs up. I'll subscribe to my channel. You can do it down below. I would, would appreciate it. See you on the next one. Bye guys.